Welcome to Daily IQ. Today 29th October 2024. In this video, I will teach you top 20 current affairs MCQ with detailed explanation. Question number 1, which team has won the 2024 ACC Mains Emerging Teams Asia Cup? Answer is Afghanistan A. The Afghanistan A men's cricket team defeated the Sri Lankan A side by 7 wickets to win the ACC men's T20 Emerging Teams Asia Cup 2024. The Asian Cricket Council organized the 6th ACC men's Emerging Teams Asia Cup in Oman from 18 to 27 October 2024. Allah Muhammad Ghanner of Afghanistan was the player of the match for his fine bowling. Sadiqullah Atal of Afghanistan was declared player of the series for his 368 runs in the tournament. Question number 2. How many medals were won by India at the Japan Para Badminton Internationals 2024? Answer is 24 medals. Indian para badminton players has delivered an impressive performance at the Japan Para Badminton Internationals 2024 by winning 24 medals, 6 gold, 9 silver and 9 bronze. The Japan Para Badminton Internationals 2024 was held in Tokyo, Japan from 22 to 27 October 2024. It was a level 2 category para badminton tournament. Shivrajan Solomlai won two gold medals for India in this Tokyo event. Question number 3. India has finished the under 23 World Wrestling Championships 2024 with how many medals? Answer is 9 medals. The Indian wrestling contingent finished its under 23 World Wrestling Championships 2024 campaign with 9 medals, 1 gold, 1 silver. and 7 bronze The under 23 World Wrestling Championships 2024 was organized by the World Wrestling Governing Body United World Wrestling and hosted by Albania in Tehran from 21 to 27th October 2024 Last year also Indian contingent won total 9 medals 1 gold to silver and 6 bronze medals at the under 23 World Wrestling Championships 2023 held in Tirana Question number 4 Who is the third Indian wrestler to win a gold in the under 23 World Wrestling Championships Answer is Chirag Chikara Chirag Chikara won the solitary gold medal for India in the under 23 World Wrestling Championships 2024 He won the gold medal in the men's freestyle 57 kilograms event Chirag Chikara is the third Indian wrestler to win a gold medal in the U23 World Wrestling Championships after Paris Olympic bronze medalists Aman Sehrawat and Ritika Hudda. Question number 5 Who has become India's first port to be listed on the Environmental Ship Index ESI platform? Answer is Mormugao Port. Goa based Mormugao Port Authority became the first indian port to be listed on the environmental ship index esi portal for its harit shreya program it was acknowledged by the international association of ports and harbors iaph mormugao's harit shreya scheme launched in october 2023 offers discounts on port charges for ships with high esi scores promoting reduced emissions Question number 6 Bibhav Kumar Talukdar from which state has received the Harry Messel award Answer is Assam Assam based conservation scientist Bibhav Kumar Talukdar has been awarded the prestigious Harry Messel award for conservation leadership by the Species Survival Commission of the International Union for Conservation of Nature IUCN in Abu Dhabi This honor awarded during the 5th IUCN SSC leaders meeting on 25th October 2024 acknowledges his groundbreaking contributions to species conservation particularly for asian rhinos through both leadership and on ground initiatives 
Question number 7. The 20th edition of the Jasmandu Music Festival has been organized in. Answer is Kathmandu. The 20th edition of Jasmandu, also known as the Kathmandu Jazz Festival, light up Kathmandu with an electrifying week of jazz, world music, and cultural fusion from 24th to 30th October 2024. Jasmandu has established itself as one of South Asia's top jazz festivals, bringing together musicians and spectators from all over the world for a week of performances, seminars, and musical fusion. Question number 8. Who has been appointed as the Managing Director of NAFT? Answer is Deepak Agrawal. The Appointments Committee has appointed Deepak Agrawal, a 2000 batch IS officer from the Uttar Pradesh cadre, as the new Managing Director, MD, of the National Agriculture Cooperative Marketing Federation of India Limited, NAFT. This appointment is set for a period of five years signifying a stable leadership aimed at enhancing the efficiency and reach of NAFT, a pivotal organization in India's agricultural sector. Question number 9. Kanka Raju, who died recently, belongs to which profession? Answer is folk dancer. The legendary Gusadi folk dancer Kanka Raju, also known as Gusadi Raju, passed away on 25th October 2024 due to age-related ailments. He was 84 years old. Kanka Raju was born in the Malwai village in Jainur Mandal of Komaram Bhim Asifabad district in Telangana. Kanka Raju, who belonged to the Raj Gaon tribe, learned the Gusadi dance on his own since he was 8 years old by watching his tribal community performing the dance. Question number 10. Who has become the first firm at Gift IFSC to receive BAT license? Answer is Incorp Global. Singapore-based Incorp Global PT Limited has become the first firm at the Gujarat International Finance Tech City, Gift, International Financial Services Center, IFSC, to obtain a BATF, bookkeeping, accounting, taxation, and financial crime compliance license. Under the IFSCA, BAT Services, Regulations 2024, this license authorizes Incorp Global to offer BAT services to businesses beyond the banking, financial services, and insurance, BFSI sectors. Question number 11. Who has won the 2024 F1 United States Grand Prix? Answer is Charles Leclerc. Ferrari's Charles Leclerc won the title at the Formula 1 F1 United States Grand Prix 2024, held on 20th October 2024 in Austin, Texas, USA. This marks Charles Leclerc's third title of the 2024 season after Italy Grand Prix and Monaco Grand Prix. Ferrari's Carlos Sainz finished second and Red Bull Racing Honda RBPT's Max Verstappen finished third. Question number 12. K.A.P. Sinha has been appointed as the Chief Secretary of which state? Answer is Punjab. The Punjab government has appointed K.A.P. Sinha, a 1992-batch IS officer, as the Chief Secretary of Punjab, replacing Anurag Verma. He become the 43rd Chief Secretary of Punjab. He will also hold the additional charge of Principal Secretary, Personnel, Vigilance and General Administration. Anurag Verma, a 1993 batch IAS officer, served as the Chief Secretary of Punjab since 26 June 2023. Question number 13. The Dhyan Chand Lifetime Achievement Award was recently replaced by Answer is Arjuna Award Lifetime The Sports Ministry on 24th October 2024 announced the discontinuation of the Major Dhyan Chand Lifetime Achievement Award from this year onwards and the introduction of the Arjuna Award Lifetime in its place. Instituted in 2002, the Dhyan Chand Lifetime Award Named after hockey wizard Major Dhyan Chand, 
a legendary Indian field hockey player who scored more than 1,000 international goals during a career which spanned over 20 years from 1926 to 1948. Question number 14. Who has been ranked as top central banker by the US Best Global Finance magazine? Answer is Shaktikanta Das. Reserve Bank of India Governor Shaktikanta Das has been ranked the top central banker by the US Best Global Finance magazine on 26 October 2024. This is the second consecutive year that he has been ranked as the top central banker globally. Denmark's Christian Kettle Thomson and Switzerland's Thomas Jordan have also been ranked under the A plus category of central bankers. Question number 15. Mohammad Rizwan become the captain of which country's ODI and T20 team? Answer is Pakistan. Mohammad Rizwan has been appointed Pakistan's new ODI and T20 international captain, taking over from Babar Azam after a series of disappointing World Cup performances. While Salman Ali Agha has been named as his deputy captain, Mohammad Rizwan has played 74 ODIs and won 0 to T20 internationals for Pakistan. In both the formats, Rizwan averages 40.15 in ODIs and 48.72 in T20 internationals. Question number 16. Who has been selected in the International Tennis Hall of Fame of 2025? Answer are both Maria Sharpova and Brian Brothers. Five-time Grand Slam singles champion Maria Sharpova and the record-breaking American twins Bob and Mike Bryan have been selected for the International Tennis Hall of Fame's class of 2025. Maria Sharpova, now 37, made history as the first Russian woman to achieve the world number one ranking in 2005. Over her illustrious career, she won all four Grand Slam titles, becoming one of only 10 women to complete a career Grand Slam. Question number 17. Who recently became the first Indian to win the title of Miss Grand International? Answer is Rachel Gupta. Rachel Gupta, a 20-year-old from Punjab, became the first Indian to win the coveted Miss Grand International 2024 title on 25th October. She has previously shown her constant superiority in international competitions by winning the title of Miss Super Talent of the World in 2022. She won the Miss Grand India title in August 2024, which paved the way for her to compete for the Miss Grand International title. Question number 18. Airbus has inaugurated its new India and South Asia headquarters in which city? Answer is New Delhi. Airbus recently inaugurated its India and South Asia headquarters and training center in the National Capital Region, NCR, New Delhi, signifying a substantial investment in India's aerospace sector. This state-of-the-art facility, equipped with the 320 simulators, aims to train up to 800 pilots and 200 technicians annually, supporting India's growing aviation needs. Question number 19. Which country become the first to stop generating electricity from coal? Answer is United Kingdom. United Kingdom became first country to stop electricity production from coal. The world's first coal plant opened in London, UK, in 1882. Whereas India installed its first major thermal power plant, the Hussain Sagar Thermal Power Station in Hyderabad in 1920. Question number 20. World Psoriasis Day is observed every year on. Answer is 29th October. World Psoriasis Day is observed every year on 29th October to make the general public aware of the important facts related to psoriasis and this disease and its treatment. World Psoriasis Day 2024 theme is Family to honor the support families provide to psoriatic patients.
Psoriasis is a serious abnormal skin condition in which red and white scaly patches start developing on the patient's skin. The first World Psoriasis Day was observed in 2004. Thanks for watching full video. You can join in our membership plan for daily, weekly and monthly current affairs PDFs. Please contact me on WhatsApp. My WhatsApp number is 9700200378.